Hey guys, welcome home to beautiful, beautiful Powder Springs. As you can tell, some absolutely gorgeous, gorgeous houses out here. I have a client that's building right now. Hey, Erica <laughs> and Buster. Um, so I was out here and wanted to give you a tour of, this is the only standing inventory home they have currently right now. You could also build from the ground up. I think there might be like about 95 lots still available. Community of the year out here in Cobb County. This one's priced at 720,000, some change like 720, 622. Just did a $20,000 incentive. It used to be 740. So great opportunity as you could tell. The attention to detail, the brick, the stone, the whitewashed brick, the columns. Uh, pure, pure luxury. It's it's for the luxury home buyer that uh, wants a certain lifestyle, uh, certain amenities. They've got amazing pool, clubhouse, gym. They have recreation, bocce courts, a uh, little entertainment stage close to Kennesaw, Marietta. And uh, as you can tell, just absolutely beautiful, beautiful homes out here. So let's take a look. I'm going to Lock it up behind me so that nobody disturbs this tour. And I think you're gonna be really, really impressed. Uh, I'm gonna get some nice incentives as well. I use one of their preferred lenders. So when you come in, you can see just this beautiful, rich honeycomb, I would call it, color, hardwood floors, exquisite, you know, entranceway. Notice the details in the trim work. Pull over here to the right. This is a really, really nice size with tray ceilings, double trim work and base trim work. Uh, a den, a study, a conversation room, a piano room, art gallery, really flexible and what you would want to use it for. Um, you know, beautiful large window here, all framed out again. Over here to the left, you see the doorway the beautiful doorway very very nice size uh, dining room notice the high wainscoting trim about halfway up the wall coffered ceilings beautiful um very much on trend chandelier I guess this is just stage so this furniture won't come with it and if it's not your taste obviously you know, at this price point, you're going to have your own taste. Um, and, you know, we'll see maybe if we could get you blinds or something like that included as well. But uh, beautiful, long, you know, table that they're showcasing here. But you can use whatever table you want. We're going to enter into the formal family room. Look at the beautiful fireplace with the granite all around it. Uh, it's a gas fireplace, very, very large room. Here they're showing it with couch, uh, two couches, uh, which looks really nice, but you can do sectionals, right? They also have it, here you have a chair here, big area rug. It's anchored by windows, double windows on each side. Just really, really luxurious. One of the big things with this builder, the attention to details, but also their kitchens. Ugh. I could hear everybody out there. I know how I am when it comes to my kitchens. This is the premier chef kitchen that people are looking for. Not your everyday island, right? You have gigantic, looks like quartz material. Um, you could obviously put your um, uh, stools underneath. You could do so much with this space. Love the offsetting gold. Very, very much what I'm seeing on trend. Um, gold is making a comeback to offset the stainless steel. Um, but you're still getting the stainless steel. Look at the cabinets all the way to the top of the ceilings. The white um, backsplash. The beautiful. Look at the details again. Look at the handles that are chosen. This is where your refrigerator will go. We'll see if we can get that included as well. Absolutely everything that people want right now. You got the double ovens plus the microwave. Uh, just a wall of useful um, appliances all within one space. Great use of space. Their KitchenAid, as you could tell, beautiful quality brand. 
I love these that have the um, that purplish color inside of them. You get two of those, your microwave, and this, like again, wall of cabinetry. In addition, you're gonna get what they call like a dry bar area. Love the offsetting colors again on the, the cabinetry. Turn this light on. Now, is this a pantry or is this a pantry, right? One, two, three, four, five. So 10 shelves, nice and long, a lot of storage space. In addition, you're gonna get a, what they would consider, I would say either a keeping room, but I would call this a sunroom. Notice the high vaulted ceilings, the the um, the detail of the, the beam on top. And they're using this right now as just a conversation room. Of course, you could do another table in here if you wanted to as well, but I love the use of space. I mean, just nothing but a wall, wall, wall of windows. Again, the view here, think about entertaining. Think about if you have kids being in a top school district. Um, one thing I didn't show you yet too is look at this. I love the offsetting color between the gray, giving you uh, contrast with a big vent hood. Look at this big five burner gas cooktop and the ever popular farm sink. This is in granite. Uh, it's either granite or quartz material and a KitchenAid dishwasher. Stunning, absolutely stunning. All right, we've got a covered back patio, which I know you guys love. Fully done and completed. Got the pillars in between. So much useful space. That's the vent for your gas fireplace. And I'll step back out here so you can kind of see. This will be your backyard. Again, end, end uh, corner lock. Look at all this outdoor space that you have, right? covered i mean you could put a fireplace out here if you wanted to obviously fence it in um and you're on a cul-de-sac lots of brick and stone just absolutely beautiful i see a lot of you know the dark brown or the gray hardwoods so so nice to see um this kind of like i said honeycomb color I love, again, the contrast with the gray cabinets, which I love. Look at the little glass ones up at top, but the, the contrast of the, uh, the honeycomb color for the island with the honeycomb color of the vent hood. Hardwoods up the stairs with the banister. We'll go up there in a second. This is a five bedroom, guys, so tons of space. Does not have a basement, but you really don't need it and you're gonna save yourself about 60,000 on a house this size for a basement and just plenty, plenty of space. Obviously brand new carpet, paint looks like the agreeable gray paint, probably nine foot ceilings down here, really feels open. I'd say a queen or a full size bed. How many times have you seen a walk-in closet in a secondary bedroom? You know, this is what you're gonna get in the 700s price point. LED lights, we won't have to change those for probably 10, 15 years. You have a connecting door to the bathroom, but it's also shared for the main guest as well. Look at the size of this bathroom. You have granite countertops, gray cabinets, the rectangle uh, sink, very much on trend, and then a fully frameless glass shower. Again, fully tiled all the way to the basin. Obviously, you could have fun. You, got, you could definitely fit two people in here <laughs> if you want to. Again, the size of the doorways, right? That's the connecting door. So anybody's using that bedroom downstairs will have direct access. Coat closet, double doors, built-in bench. Great for book bags, hanging up coats, shoes. Great use of space. Again, what you expect at this price point. Another cloak closet. Did I mention it's a three car garage? You probably saw that. Got two here. One on this side. Look how long it is. Your irrigation system is in here as well. Big, big water, hot water heater. Garage door openers are included as well. 
What do you say we head upstairs to look at the other four bedrooms, including the ever important master? Ah, just absolutely love this. Love this builder, love this floor plan. If you want to build from the ground up, you can. Prices start in the 400s to about the 700s. And, uh, but this one is going to give you a great deal because again, you just got $20,000 probably worth of equity in the house. So up here, because you don't have the basement, loft space. Not just any loft space. Notice the high ceilings again, tray ceilings, wall of windows. Guys, this could be your theater room, right? You could do build outs. You could do a build out on this wall. You could do shiplap along this wall. Decorator's dream right here. All right, let's look at some bedrooms. Bedroom number two, because we saw the one downstairs. Gorgeous. Queen size bed, no problem. Closet. Again, look at this view. These houses are just absolutely stunning. You like any of those, these lots right here? You could build from the ground up. <clears throat> Connecting bathroom. Again, the feature that I love. Again, at this price point, things that you would expect. Look at the tile work around the tub. Little touches, right? The transom window. A little separation here for the uh, toilet closet. All tile. We'll see any vinyl yet so far, although vinyl has come a long way. Look at the size of this room, guys. This would be a master bedroom in a lot of floor plans. California king for a secondary bedroom. Again, the windows. Just absolutely beautiful. Three car garage, tons of hardwoods, chef's kitchen, a sunroom, bedrooms to just absolutely admire and love. Walk-in closet. It's better known three. Again, use of space. Don't have to leave the hallway. Jack and Jill bathroom, overextended tile, about 12 inches. You got the double. Rectangle sinks again, again, right on trend. Beautiful cabinetry, love it. Again, separation. Somebody's brushing their teeth. If you're sharing this bathroom, you have porcelain tub, glazed tile, gray toilet. Again, another gigantic room. I'd say on this one, you could do a king. I probably would do a queen, two nightstands. This is your sunroom below. Remember we saw the vaulted ceilings here? It's a nice size lot, all fenced, fenced in. You don't even need to build a pool because the pool and clubhouse is right down there. Walk-in closet. I love this loft space. That's the master, we'll finish with that. But I wanna show you Look at the washroom. Again, what's the touch? Sink right in here. LED lights. Linen closet, wrought iron, wood banisters. And finally, your own vestibule as you enter your double door master. Bedroom, wall of windows, double tray ceilings. You see one, two, recessed lighting, dry bar in here so you got a coffee bar in the morning if you want one of two closets one really nice size by itself anyways love that double door here's the master bath oh the tile so on trend double vanity sinks huge soaking tub rain head and wall unit and Another unit inside of there. Look at the frameless glass. The details in the tile work. Big window. Look at those houses. Oh, just absolutely love it. Toilet, closet, second master walk-in closet. And again, after the fact, if you want to do California closets, every feature you want, guys. Five bedrooms, four bath. Sunroom, tons of tile, tons of hardwood, frameless glass. Hit me up, 720.
and a little bit of change.